Welcome to the Red Kingdom. Yeah. Red Kingdom. Good, Good morning, morning Saints. Saints. Today is Monday, February 12th, 2024. Happy birthday today to Daniel Ballou, Joel Hendrickson, and Sloan Jacobson. The saying of the day today is Saint Apollonia. When an angry pagan mob began persecuting Christians in Alexandria, most Christians began to flee, but Saint Apollonia stayed. The mob beat her and knocked out all of her teeth and threatened to throw her into the fire if she did not curse God. She considered for a second and then jumped into the fire on her own volition. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, meatball sub and chips. Mm, mm, mm. The gold out basketball game is February 16th, so we are selling shirts during lunch for the rest of the week and throughout ne for Throughout this week. Throughout this week. You can wear the st shirts during school on that Friday and at the basketball game against Blue Valley. The shirts are $15 and the proceeds go to St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. So come to the common stage to get a shirt for a good cause. This week in the forensics team was in action at Olathe South. Congratulations to Michael Kamani for finishing second in pros and qualifying for state. Boys golf tryout meeting will be this Friday, this week on Friday after school in room 120. The National Honor Society's blood drive was a success. We had 31 new donors and collected 58 units of blood. Those units will save 174 lives. Great job, Saints. The two blood drive raffle winners are Lily Finnan for the donor raffle and Caroline Drogi for the referral raffle. Please come to the counselor's office before the end of the day to collect your gift card. Track and field season starts on Monday, February 26. If you'd like to join the team, please get signed up in advance by using the QR code on the posters in the halls. Email or talk to Coach Wrigley if you have any questions. Interested in seeing the rehearsal process for this year's winter play? The cast of the Awesome 80s Prom needs your help. We need people to fill in for audience members on Tuesday and Wednesday this week. We are offering service hours. This requires active participation with cast members, and we hope to see you there. And now a video from Mr. Rose. Decision making, the cat and mouse, Pat Mahomes, Patty taking us down. How does he handle all that pressure? All the decision making. Speaking of psychology, I teach psychology, and those are the kind of things we look at the brain, why we act a certain way. We do a lot of uh, hands on demonstrations to make it interesting. So um, I would love to see psychology grow. I know you're getting ready to look at schedules. We are now adding an AP psychology, which is just an extension second semester with a few new units like memory, learning, personality. So I'd love to see it grow. Take a look at that. In theory, I guess we could have a regular psychology second semester too. So you could take a semester and you could take a semester and then AP section. Go Chiefs. Have a great day. The Gina Rossello Basketball Tournament is February 18th from 4 o'clock p.m. You can enter with the current C CYO basketball team or you can create one. Team entries are due super... They were due they yesterday. They were due yesterday. The entry fee is $5 per person to be on the team, and you can only have two outside players on your team. The team that wins the championship will receive shirts for each of their players. WPA photos can be found on the Saints website. Go to the About page and then find Saints images. It'll take you to a link, click on 2023-2024 Saints Images, and scroll down and find WPA. And thanks to M Michelle Gress for taking photos. And now a video from Mr. Blaze. Howdy, everyone. It's Mr. Blaze here with the Campus Ministry Minute or Corner or whatever update, whatever we want to do. Go Chiefs! Uh, we will have Mass at 720 in the chapel on Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday this week. Did you know that it is actually okay to be late to daily mass? Just join us as quietly as possible. Lit starts on Monday. Just like we actually appreciate the feedback from a teacher through like one of those bell ringers or an exit slip or an entry slip or whatever your teacher is doing, you like having a little feedback. I don't know about you, but if you get tired of playing in preseason competition, you're tired of playing each other, you actually are excited for the big game because you're going to actually figure out where are you at? That's what Lent is. The 40 days in the desert was Jesus being tempted by worldly things, checking in with if Jesus could really do this. You too should reflect on how tempted you are by worldly things during Lent. 
we are all asked to reflect on ways our lives are not in line with God's will. Before Lent, reflect on three areas you can improve your life. One, prayer. How can you set aside more time for God each day? Mass, adoration, rosary, the examine. You can figure something out to bring more prayer life into your day. Fast. Uh, what earthly things are distracting me from God in my daily life? Give. Our needs go down and our blessings go up when we spend time focused on giving to others. Lastly, please join us for a special Mass at 8.30 a.m. in the gym on Ash Wednesday. This Mass is open to the public. Bring your family, your friends from other schools, Patrick Mahomes, anybody you want to bring. If you cannot make it, Please check with your parish for Mass times. Most churches have several times, and almost all of them have one before the parade and after the parade. And that's all I have for you guys. Um, and uh, this is, yeah, see you later. Bye. I didn't write it. And now time for the dad joke of the day. How do chickens encourage their football team? How do they do it? They egg them on. <laughs> Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We will be back with more for you tomorrow. I'm Karen. And I'm Ian. Signing, Signing off. off. Remember, stay classy, saints, and together we shine.